Hey friend and welcome to this part two of the Light Elegance Gel Polish P Plus series. If you haven't watched part one yet, make sure that you go ahead and do that after you finish this video. But now let me just give you a tutorial on how to use these amazing products. So for a gel polish overlay, just go in with the cutie base, the color, and then the top gloss. So for a soak off overlay or an extension, you can use Tac plus Jimmy Gel plus the color and the top gloss. Tack is actually optional, but use it if you want to wear the nails a little bit longer. For a hard gel overlay or extension, go in with Tack, one step, the color, and the top gloss. In this case, though, Tack is not optional and should be part of the service for maximum adhesion. Before we move on though, I just want to show you what my nails look like right now. This is Tac Jimmy Gel and the P Plus and I have no lifting whatsoever. Regardless of which combination you want to proceed with, you want to start out with your prep work. So pushing down the cuticles, clean up the nail plate, make sure that everything is nice and neat. Wipe it with your cleanser and you are ready to go. Starting off with the cutie base for just a regular gel polish overlay. This is a product that will speed up the soak off time. So you will only have to soak it for about seven to 10 minutes. Going in with the color and the first thing you want to do is actually shake the bottle. After that, we want to make sure that we have a nice thin amount of product onto our brush because we don't want to flood the nail. So rather go a little bit too less than too much. Start off by applying it to half the nail, cap the edge, and then continue with your cuticle area. And once again, really make sure that you're applying this very, very thin and then go ahead and cure. Now we're moving on to our second layer and it should be just as thin as the first one. Make sure that you are capping the free edge. And once you're happy with that, you can go ahead and cure. Now, last part is the top coat. So apply that evenly onto the nail. Double check so you don't got any dust particles in there, cap the edge and cure. Cleanse and there's your finished nail. Easy peasy. For our Jimmy Gel extension, we're gonna start out with tack. And as mentioned, this is an optional step, but if you want this to last a little bit longer, then we do recommend you to put down a layer of tack first. Now going in with our form, applying that to the finger, make sure that it is coming straight up from the finger. And if you want to custom cut it, you can go ahead and do that. If you haven't heard about the Jimmy Gel before, I will link some videos down in the description box for you. But basically it's a soak off builder gel in a bottle that acts like a hard gel. So you can make nice long extensions with it, but they're still flexible and you can soak it off if you want to. However, I would maybe recommend you to go in and file it down as much as you can before soaking the last part off because it's going to take a little bit longer. So if you are specifically looking for something that you can actually soak off or your clients can soak off at home, then I would recommend the first combination with just the cutie base, the color, and then the top coat. A couple of fun facts before we move on to the color step. If you didn't know, all the Light Elegance products are 100% hema free, nine free, vegan, cruelty free, and gluten free. So you can always feel very safe when you are using these products. So let's go in with our first layer of color. Once again, you want to apply this very thin and you want to make sure that you don't have too much product on your brush when you start to apply this first and second layer. This is something that I did in the beginning and it just flooded the cuticles all the time. But once I just learned how much product I needed on my brush, it worked so much better. Now here's our second layer. And if you haven't noticed, 
All the colors and glitters cure for 30 seconds in LED, 2 minutes in UV. The top, the cutie base and the Jimmy gel cures for 1 minute in LED and 2 minutes in UV. Finishing off with the P Plus top coat and this is actually really important. You can't use the hard gel top gloss or super shiny on this because it will crack. So you will have to finish off with the same system as you use for your colors or glitter. So that is super important. Cleanse and here are your nails. So we got a natural gel polish manicure and then an extension using the Jimmy gel with the P plus on top. So let's remove this. The first thing you want to do is to take your file and file through the top coat. That is going to help you a lot. Then you want to take your LE Pro remover or some acetone and drench a little cotton ball with the acetone. Put some foil around the finger and then we're going to leave it for seven minutes. Pro tip, you can actually speed up the soak up time a little bit by adding heat to this process. While that nail is soaking, let's move on to the middle finger. And here you just simply remove that color layer with your speedy bit. After that, you wanna prep the outgrown part of the nail. So if you wanna apply tack, you can go ahead and do that. Rebalance using the Jimmy Gel and then apply your color on top again. Super fast and easy in fill. Let's take a look at the first nail. And this looks very nice and bubbly. So we're gonna start using an orange stick to peel that off. You don't want to use any sharp tools or anything like that. So make sure to use something that's a little bit nicer to the natural nail. If you didn't get everything off, just go ahead and rough up the surface a little bit more and go back to your little foil package. If you want to try these products out and the Hello Kit, you can go to lightelegance.com or find it at your closest distributor. And I really do recommend you to try this out. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.